Hey, how's it going, guys? Zombie back with some more Borderlands number one, the first one that came out. So, I went out and did some uh, side missions. I have not moved on from the uh, Sledge's Mind Gate key. This is my skill tree so far. I have the shock damage, have the elemental chance, and then went for a corrosive kind of melee thing. Along with the side missions, I got the uh, I got the incendiary and shock artifact. Yeah, artifact. And these will just allow me to do uh, incendiary and shock damage on my action skill. Just so you guys know that. Um, I'm gonna try to get down to Phoenix and then uh, probably go down this tree quite a bit. And who knows from there? But. We left off, we were trying to get to Sledge, and... Oh, wow, okay, that was... I didn't mean to do that, but okay. But we we left off trying to get to Sledge, we got hit, we got the key from the uh, Roid Rage Maniac kind of guy. Everything you've faced up until now has been simple. You're about to face a real challenge in Sledge. Do not underestimate him. Oh, I'm going to underestimate him because I know I'm overleveled. Because first off, this bitch is level 17. I'm 18. You know what? Fuck you, Claptrap. I literally completed all those side missions and you could have just told me, Hey, 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 there's side missions right before you go in. Are you fucking shitting me? Come on, man. Oh, and I've been getting all these upgrades, too, so. Yeah. Had to make sure I got the last upgrade. So, in the spirit of October, I'm a big Halloween, uh, I'm a big Halloween guy, and I love horror movies, so, in the comments, tell me what your favorite horror movie is. I genuinely want to know, because I, I, I'm a big fan of, uh, a lot of the Halloween movies, I, I'm, I have a weird hor horror thriller kind of movie that is, uh, definitely unique. Some people wouldn't even consider it a, a horror movie because it was kind of a. It's a weird one. It has Jeff Goldblum and I can't remember what the lady's name was. Um, is that better than my revolver? Um, but it has Jeff Goldblum and it, and he basically is trying to build a uh, teleporter because he's uh, he gets motion sick. I'm going to try not to spoil too much of it if you guys want to watch it. But it's just about time travel and making it, and he accidentally turned himself into a fly, all that kind of shit. You guys probably have heard of it. It's called The Fly with Jeff Goldblum. It's uh, one of my favorites. I don't know why. There's literally only one on you. Shut up. You better run. What are you? Scared or something? Get up. Yeah, I'm scared. Whenever you guys are sitting here using like
Yeah. I'm scared. I'm literally running into these situations with literally a pistol, an AR, and a fucking SMG. While you guys have, like, multiple guns all up against me, and you're sit call sitting here calling me scared. I'd, li I'd like to th I'd like to think that I was right in that case, but I don't know. You might be right. I don't know. Get those some bitches. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. You get, you get what you fucking deserve, dog. Jesus. Why does this thing have to tear me a fucking new asshole? Like, fuck off. Oh, you're a cunt. Excuse me, I shot you in the fucking head. Fuck you, dude. Alright, now you guys are gonna get what you fucking deserve. Fuck you, dog. Fuck you. I'm definitely gonna need a new shield soon. I could already feel it kind of partially dropping off. I thought I was going to be over leveled, but you know. you and my and how you hit my macaroni hat my macaroni hat my macaroni hat you motherfucker i'm gonna get through this fucking place whether you like it or not ouch that had to have hurt Ouch, that had to have hurt. Right in the fucking head. Oh my god. Of course your stupid ass is here again. I hate these fucking badass bruisers. They're dicks. But that headshot didn't feel so good, bitch. There's no escaping you guys thought you could bully me for the longest time? <laughs> Fuck you, dude. You're a dickhead. This, do, this place does not go very quick, unless you do the uh, little glitches that you can do for Sledge Safe House. <laughs> Motherfucker. Literally ghosting bullets now, really? That was the biggest problem with this game and ghosting bullets. Like, it would always ghost my bullets for some fucking reason. I hated that shit. But then again, also, 
I'm using pretty low level gear compared to this. I'm still using a fucking bone shredder that's level three, like for fuck's sake, man. I could totally be rocking something that's better, you know. That just that rev this revolve wait, hold up. Idea though. So these are two different different kind of things here. That's what I thought. So I could sit here, switch this out, and do more damage that way. And still have ammo with my, uh... Okay, pretty good damage. Took out his shield, and it's doing some major fire damage on it too, so... Oh my goodness, we're, we're not even to Sledge and we're almost level 19, Jesus Christ. I hate these midget shotgunners. They're assholes. They got me pinned. We're probably not going to be level 19 before we get to Sledge. Probably after Sledge, but you know. So too, because we're kind of getting boned on the loot here. In fact, my last my last purple was a uh, Mo and Marley. I haven't even gotten a legendary yet. Which we kind of been spoiled on legendaries lately in these new games, but you know. It's kind of nice to sit here and be like, oh, where are all, where are all the legendaries instead of, oh, I have too many legendaries sometimes. Like, you, you get that way sometimes, and I get it. But I, I find myself like, bro, why, why am I missing legendary? Oh. Actually. Oh. I want that. <laughs> I fucking want that. I want that. I'll come back for you. I'll come back for you. This one is a brute, and he has a powerful shield you will need to whittle down before you can hurt him. I know. Don't let him touch you. Don't let him don't let him touch me. That sounds raping. You feel thing that you do don't like? You guys aren't friends, yeah, totally. Alright, buddy. <laughs> what shield? What fucking shield? What were you talking about, Angel? What were you talking about? Where's his shield? Where's his motherfucking shield? Fuck you, dude. Damn, bro. Spam me harder, daddy. Spam me harder. 
I can't see a goddamn thing. They... Oh my god, I can't fucking stand that, man. I literally die because there's literally no way to see anything. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Thanks, Gearbox. That, that's literally another thing you could have fixed. Oh, spam me harder. Yeah, spam me harder, you fucking bitch boy. You're absolutely dog ass. Get the fuck out of my lobby, bitch boy. Thanks for your shotgun, you fucking pussy bitch. Fucking take on all my money and shit, I swear. I bet you would like to know what that is. The vault is real. Mm. What you're holding is the key that opens it. Suck a dick, One motherfucker. Well, I'm not going to be able to get the class mod for sure, but you know, it is what it is. This is Commandant Steele of the Atlas Corporation, Crimson Lance P Company, 3rd Starborn Brigade. I have just been informed that you have arrived on Pandora in search of the vault, and within minutes have started killing the locals and causing a disturbance. This planet is under the authority of the Atlas Corporation. Yeah, even with all this stuff, I'm not going to be able to get that shit. Um, hold on. Oh, the okay, artifacts go. found here are Atlas property. Possession of such property carries a stiff penalty. I invite you to turn yourself in at once to the nearest land's outpost and surrender any information or artifacts in your possession. Consider this your one and only warning. What if I don't want to? I'm, I'm going to go ahead and just, uh... Continue on my mission. You can, you can get penetrated by an alien tentacle. Fuck you, bitch. Let's see what we've got. Okay, I'll go ahead and use that. Okay, well, that was relatively easy. One death going through this entire area. Actually, two deaths, but yeah. One of them was because I couldn't see my surroundings. The other was just because I wasn't playing right, I guess. I kinda wish I had the money to buy stuff like that fucking class mod, you know? SMG ammo regen, that's pretty good. But it's way more expensive! How do you expect me to buy this shit, man? Fuck off! Okay. On we move, I guess. I swear, Claptrap, shut up! You don't have to tell me that every single time I fucking enter this area. I've done all the side missions up to this point, and you're over here like, Oh, come do these side missions, you fucking dickhead! Have I not done all the side missions so far? Shut up! My god. 
Like, I wasn't heading over this way anyways, you know? I swear, if he says, TK Baja has fucking missions for you, because I don't remember doing side missions for him recently, so he's probably dead, but you know... Hmm, how many more side missions you got for me, Clappy? Thanks to you, no more bandits. There's... There's bandits over on the other side of that fucking rock wall. Shut up. <laughs> drink to that. Busted up nine toes and beat the hell out of Sledge? You're making a name for yourself in these parts. I already... Yay, I know I received a class mod. I would have had one sooner, but you know... My god, he's doing it again! Shut up, Claptrap. Don't say it. Please don't say it. I'm coming. I'm coming. Please. Thank you. Okay, so what all, what all do I have? Jesus Christ, there's so many. I gotta go to the headstone mine, all that shit. Oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna do that later, though. This. Damn. There's no escaping, Mark. Well, off we go to bigger, better things. inside could be worth a fortune, but only if you get the right partner to help you sell it. So, partners? I need best armed mercs out there. You need something better. Hey, we're on to the blues. Cool. Wow, they're expensive, though. <laughs> All right, Clappy. Downloading and analyzing your DNA record. Human status confirmed. Access to the doll headland is granted. Please stand by while I activate the gate for you. Shut up and do it. we go to meet Ernest. How do you like my macaroni hat? Alright, so this is a side mission. We just need to go get Skagzilla on this one. Alright, makes sense. Oh, you know, luck is an 
old buddy of mine, and uh, by old buddy, I mean asshole that ruined my mom's girl parts. Well, sounds like he's in trouble, so you go on ahead and try and keep him alive long enough so I can kill him at a later occasion. So, if you guys didn't know, Lucky is referred to in Borderlands 2. Oh my god. Lucky is referred to in Borderlands 2 whenever you're doing the Zaffir and Todunk missions. And it says that Scooter killed Lucky, actually. So he did succeed in his eventual task of killing Lucky. Just if you guys didn't know that. Which I'm sure if you guys are into Borderlands as much as I am, you probably knew that. But if you didn't, now you do. Hey, yo, dude. What up? Are you gonna ever open your mouth, bastard? Good hit off of him there. Ow. What the hell? What the hell just happened? Did you guys see that? Okay, yeah, that's bullshit. You guys, you guys saw that, right? I don't know what the fuck just happened there, but it, that is some major ass bullshit. I really hope he didn't regain his health, because that would be bullshit. <laughs> Fuck you and your cheating ass. Motherfucker. Hell yeah, that's an upgrade. Not too much of an upgrade. Holy shit balls. Hi there. I will gladly take you. 
It has a faster recharge and it's just slightly lower, you know, whatever. You found a corrosive weapon. Shots fired cool. have a chance of splattering acid on your target. The acid eats through armor and flesh in no time at all, and can spread to other nearby enemies. <sighs> yeah, okay. God, lag spike, oh my god. That was definitely a big lag spike. My god. God, this game is so broken. <laughs> Bada boom. How's it going, Lucky? You gonna die. Oh, that's that's Ernest. Never mind. Ooh, the elephant gun. I forgot about that weapon. I really liked the elephant gun back in the day. But do I use it? That's the big thing. Yeah, I'll use it. Whatever. Damn. The most, the, the most closest level I have is my fucking pistol, like, Jesus Christ. And then bada bing bada boom, we got Venom complete. Awesome. Let's go. Okay. Um, so what's... Alright guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. I, the, the first two videos I did for this game, I did, uh, 45 minutes, and those were like the starters, and starting up on this game i didn't want to like shorten them up and we got out of firestone today which was my biggest goal and we got through the we got through skagzilla that's that's pretty much an achievement for me and that just made it kind of you know perfect for me but whenever we come back we'll uh we'll definitely do the getting lucky mission here we'll we'll, we'll get that done but before when i do come back i'm gonna have all these completed you guys can see all the side missions that I've done here, which is why I'm at the level I'm at. Just so you guys know, I'm not completely just cheating my way through this game. Because I'm not like that. I want to enjoy the game for what it is. But anyways, if you guys like this game, if you guys like this game, if you like the video, definitely leave a like. Comment if you guys want me to do a different build or if there's anything you guys think or that is uh, a little off. Or if you're just like, bro, this game's so broken. You know what I mean. But also, subscribe if you guys want to see some more of my content, and it'll. I'll try to keep putting it out. I have plans on playing through all the Borderlands games, including Tales from the Borderlands, Borderlands 3. Um, Borderlands 3, I'm not going to be doing the uh, DLCs because I don't. I don't feel like doing the DLCs, and I'm not going to do them in three and two. I just don't have a. I just don't enjoy them. Um, well, I do enjoy them, but I'm. I don't think people people would enjoy that as much if you guys do want to see the dlcs i will go through them each individually on uh on an individual vi video for each dlc you know but we're also going to do wonderlands we're going to do borderlands 3 borderlands 2 pre-sequel borderlands 1 which um the next game i'm, pro I'm probably going to do is pre-sequel because that is the way it's supposed to go in this timeline so it's gonna be one pre-sequel um i'm probably gonna do wonderlands after pre-sequel because it technically takes place before two while roland is still alive but we're gonna we're gonna do uh first pre-sequel wonderlands two three 
No, I'm gonna do after two. I'm gonna do Tales from the Borderlands, and then I'm gonna do three. And then after three, we'll go straight into border into Tales from the Borderlands two. I don't know where that takes place uh, story wise, but I'm gonna assume it's after three. But anyways, I, I just wanted to give you guys a set schedule, give you guys the idea of what I'm gonna be doing. I'm not gonna be doing multiple, like I'm not gonna do two playthroughs of each one. I'm not gonna get to max level, it's just for the story. And that's it. Which I'm actually enjoying playing Borderlands 1. I have not played this in a long time, so it feels very refreshing to come back to this game. So anyways, like I said, subscribe if you guys want to keep up to date with my videos and hit that little bell notification so you guys receive notifications whenever I either go live or upload. So I guess that'll be it from me, guys. I will see you in the next video or live stream. Peace out, y'all.